this video covers the synthesis of paraestomol by conventional as well as by green method uh, please like my channel watch videos as well as subscribe my channel uh, in the uh, conventional method of synthesis phenol is used as a uh, feedstock or a precursor when phenol is treated with a nitrating mixture paranitrophenol and orthonitrophenols are formed and even we may use a sodium nitrate as a reagent in the presence of sodium borohydride or even we may use a hydroxyl amine or a rani nickel paranitrophenol gets reduced to para aminophenol further on acylation acetylation on acetylation this para aminophenol with acetic anhydride acetylation means it is the process that is carried out in the presence of acetic anhydride and sodium acetate will get para estomol see uh, i'll write the reaction will take a simple molecule like a, a phenol so phenol on reaction with a nitrating mixture so the nitrating mixture is hno3 plus h2so4 giving a two compound that is a para nitrophenol and ortho nitrophenol no2 group para nitrophenol and a very trace amount of ortho nitrophenol are produce the paranitrophenol is very stable and the quantity the yield is very high compared to orthonitrophenol paranitrophenol further reacts or it react with sodium borohydride we will take a paranitrophenol paranitrophenol the nitro group in the para position and here the hydroxyl group that react with the sodium borohydride or even hydroxyl amine producing para amino phenol that is nh2 para amino phenol further it undergo acetylation reaction in the presence of acetic anhydride and sodium acetate so acetylation reaction usually take place in the presence of uh, acetic anhydride and sodium acetate so here uh, o group ch3 bar ch3 co na using para acetone that is here oh group here nh amine group with acetate that compound called it as para acetamol so this is a conventional method of synthesis that is a phenol on treated with the nitric acid and sulfuric acid forming para nitrophenol and ortho nitrophenol further para nitrophenol may to react with sodium borohydride giving para aminophenol which on acetylation producing para acetamol See, the reaction can be mentioned phenol react with uh, in, in the presence of nitric acid mixture nitrating mixture producing two compound ortho nitrophenol and para nitrophenol further the para nitrophenol react with the sodium borohydride forming para aminophenol which on acetylation in the presence of acetic anhydride and sodium acetate producing para acetone now i'll take how we synthesize the same para acetone by green method same the reagent we use phenol phenol first is subjected to acetylation process in the presence of hydrogen fluoride that is phenol undergo acetylation reaction with acetic anhydride in the presence of hydrogen fluoride gives ketone then further the ketone uh, react with the um, hydroxyl amine giving ketoxime then formed ketoxime undergo backmans rearrangement in the presence of trifluoroacetic acid thionyl chloride and the biocatalyst amber list 15 gives the final product para acetone see we'll take a phenol 
phenol first interact with the acetic anhydride that is phenol made to react with the acetic anhydride in the presence of hydrogen fluoride in the presence of hydrogen fluoride here h producing the compound called 4 hydroxy acetophenol ketone is produced that is cu h3 is that is 4 hydroxy acetophenol is produced then further this one Made to react with hydroxyl amine. Made to react with hydroxyl, that is, sorry, made to react with uh, hydroxyl amine producing heat oxide. The compound heat oxides are produced, that is, here it linked with N group and hydroxyl group, and this one is the same one, CH3. Is produced and further it undergo Bachmann's rearrangement in the presence of trifluorofluoroacetic acid, thionyl chloride, and the catalyst called umber list. Undergo Bachmann's rearrangement reaction. Bachmann rearrangement reaction. producing para that is the NH group that it is rearranged the rearranged and producing para acetamol NH group come to here and CO group that is a uh, replacement or the different configuration or replacing reaction take place rearranging reaction take place to produce a para Okay, we'll see here phenol made to react with acetic anhydride in the presence of hydrogen fluoride forming 4 hydroxy acetophenone. For the 4 hydroxy acetophenone, uh, react with hydroxyl amine, produce cryptoxine. Further, it undergo Bachmann's rearrangement in the presence of umber list catalyst producing para acetone. So, in the green way, we can able to synthesize para acetone. Thank you.